Welcome to the new episode of Selling Cypress and we are back in Florica today, but we are even closer to the sea. We're only 200 meters away from the sea. We are five minutes away from Pacos Town Center. Florica is north of Pacos on the west coast of Cyprus and we're presenting you a beautiful seven villa development. And without any further ado, let's go and check it out. So guys, welcome to this beautiful four bedroom, three bathroom villa. This is the last villa, one of seven, available on market for 770,000 euro plus VAT. This is a show villa, so it comes key ready, fully furnished with all the appliances included into the price. Very generous plot of 327 square meters with a total covered area of 171 square meters. Comes with underfloor heating, VRV systems, air conditioner throughout the whole property. So let's just take a look at the ground floor. And we're going to do things differently, aren't we? Yes. Let's start off with the kitchen area because it's super nice, super modern, very white and comes Italian. all the way from Italy. Yes. So we have everything concealed. As we said, all the appliances come with the villa. We have a dishwasher, cooker, hob, Nicely concealed fridge freezer, extractor, everything you need to create your masterpieces of a culinary. And we have on the back the glazed door, so you have a direct access to your parking behind the villa. Which is good whenever you bring in your shopping. Yes, so very, very literally handy. park your car outside on the other side of that door, get it in and packed away. Also we have plenty of storage, very nice size storage for the kitchen. And now let's continue into the open plan dining and living area. I know, honey, you love this monochromatic look of the floors. Yeah, this is super modern, matte finish against uh, other villas that we've been in with shiny finishes. So caters for a taste of those that do like to have a more, I would say, masculine feel to the property yes. with a great area for six people to have uh, dining, of course, you could put in a bigger table because there's uh, definitely yes, more room in space. here. And a very functional living area, yeah? Yes, very functional again. Minimalistic, sharp, clean lines. Very comfortable sofa, I have to say. Beautiful evening, watching TV, maybe something on Netflix. Relaxing or entertaining with your friends and guests having them over. Speaking of having friends or guests over. Let's have a look outside, yeah, yes. into the social space where you can put your outdoor living area through Ooh. this uh, glazed okay. door, door to ceiling door. <laughs> yeah. So look outside, what a beautiful outdoor area. So we have here a small garden on the side of the villa. Plenty of space to put your outdoor dining furniture along with barbecue. Yes, I'm sure every man would like their barbecue men kind of cooking station. And look at this, we're having a private swimming pool, staggering seven by three and a half meters, very generous size. So if you are lazy on some days to go to the beach, which is just 200 meters away, you can always just jump to the pool and refresh yourself. Very generous plot with a lot of plants, very green, very airy. So lots of space outside here to do socializing. Oh, absolutely. And uh, on that, let's head inside. I think we've got a powder room on this floor and a one of the, guest bedrooms. One of the uh, bedrooms, bedroom four in this property. Yes. So let's take a look at the guest bedroom. Again, we have an access to the garden, floor to ceiling window, beautiful breeze, as you can see. Very nice size bedroom with plenty of storage. 
As I mentioned before, every bedroom will have an air conditioner integrated. And if we pass the kitchen, we have a small powder room here on the ground floor. Passing by, we have also the concealed washing machine for yeah, your laundry, nice with a space way. for your basket or whatsoever, and a nice powder room to use for guests or whenever you are downstairs. So let's take a look upstairs now. So on that, let's have a look at the upstairs of this property. Okay guys, let's go upstairs in this beautiful marble state-of-the-art staircase. Let's go and we'll see you upstairs. So as Marina comes up the stairs from the ground floor to the first floor here, one thing I really like about this staircase are these windows, really huge windows that just floods this staircase with natural daylight. Yes, and the sun just reflects into the marble, makes it very shiny, very rich and stylish finish. I just love this space, very, very light and airy indeed. So, <laughs> so we're on the first floor, we've got three bedrooms on here, but we're gonna start off with the family bathroom that serves those that are in bedrooms two and three. Yes, and take a look at the walk-in shower, beautiful chrome finish. Let's take a size test. Yes, one, two, three marinas can easily fit inside. <laughs> this is typical marina <laughs> yes. size test, I love it. But you can see that the actual finish of the uh, taps, the um, shower head, etc. really nice chrome finish. Also has natural daylight, yes, which is a must in these bathrooms windows. for the uh, for fresh air. And what's good about this uh, actual bathroom is it's got a heated tower rail that gives you that kind of heat that you need in the cooler months of the winter here in Cyprus. Yes, very nice, very stylish finish and spacious family bathroom. Also really good high quality uh, finish to the sink, the toilet, etc. all integrated into the wall. So let's have a look at bedroom three. Yes, let's go into bedroom number three. Here we have, again, January size, we have two single beds, plenty of daylight, plenty of storage as of wardrobes, very nice, subtle, grey, minimalistic finish, very cosy feeling, I would say. And again, we have an air conditioner inside, so lovely, cosy bedroom. Okay, bedroom three done. Let's head to bedroom two next to the master bedroom, which is a little bit special, this one, because yes. this one actually has a king-size bed in here, plenty of space around the bed, so it shows you it's a generous size. Yes, very, very generous. Again, we have plenty of storage for the wardrobes, generous size of the storage and take a look at this we have a Juliet balcony with a beautiful dark wood finish I just love it makes it very warm very cozy feeling and we can see on the opposite one of the villas from the same development so you can take a look what this villa is looking like on the outside beautiful finish yeah I think this is a really nice touch to have a, a terrace on bedroom two rather yes. than many villas that we've been to of three and four beds yes. that only have a terrace outside. And this and bed looks very inviting indeed. Yeah, 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 this yeah. is good. So that's bedrooms two, three and four covered off. Let's look at the masterpiece of this villa, which is the master bedroom. Beautiful, stunning finish of the master bedroom. Again, we have a beautiful, king size, very inviting looking bed. The whole finish again is monochrome, minimalistic black and gray with a splash of white, I would say. Lovely, lovely bedroom. We have a lot of storage, again, in the wall, just lovely integrated. We are nearly seamless, but again, very spacious. And here we have a private end suite for the master bedroom. With a beautiful finish, again, the sink. We have a storage under the sink. Go on, and dear <laughs> Marina. <laughs> One, two, three marinas for just a master and suite. Beautiful finish. And the window, again, to give you the daylight with the tower rail, rail the heated tower rail, again, giving that heat that you need in the winters. I really like the fact that they put in a window in here in the shower, just to give you that natural daylight. And uh, yeah, finished off again, once again, with really nice sink, taps, uh, and the toilet built into the wall. It so, all looks matte and shiny at the same time, very nice combination. But let's head out to something that we both really like, which is this terrace that's off the first floor uh, bedroom that 
gives you stunning, stunning views. And it's not just one terrace, it's actually a wraparound terrace, which again, you don't find in many villas. Yes, take a look at this beautiful wooden floor, just gives you this nice and warm finish. You can walk out with your bare feet and just enjoy the sensation of the wood. Lovely breeze coming from the sea. We see just behind this resort, Eleni Village. As I said, 200 meters away. On the far end, we have Coral Bay, just three kilometers away, but you can see it from here, from your balcony. Lovely, lovely, beautiful finish. And, and views down onto the swimming pool. So you can keep a check on the kids if you've got them in the pool up here and lots of space around the whole of the villa and like I said I love this wrap around roof terrace from uh, the master bedroom. Perfect spot to come out and have your morning coffee just take the day in yes kind of a zen moment I just love it. So, so I think on that let's pop downstairs and give a summary of the key facts and stats of this villa. Yes we'll see you downstairs. Okay guys, as, and as we are back downstairs, let me just remind you that this is the last villa of seven villas development. This is a show villa, so it comes fully furnished here ready with all appliances included into the price. The price as of September 2023 is 770,000 euro plus VAT. The total plot is 327 square meters with a total covered area of 171 square meters. We have a private pool of seven by three and a half meters. We have VRV systems, underfloor heating, and the air conditioner throughout the entire property. If you're interested in this beautiful stunning villa just down Cloraca, 200 meters from the beach, please don't hesitate to contact us. Write us email on info at silentcypress.com or give us a comment down below with your feedback. Or if you're interested, please consider subscribing if you like this kind of videos. Give us some like and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you, bye.